It's an electioneering season, and that's what has drawn the all-progressive Grand Alliance governorship candidates in Ebonyi State, Professor Bernard Odo, to Lagos State. He's campaigning in a new way by seeking partnership with two steel companies. First on the list is Top Steel Nigeria Limited in the Korodu area of Lagos, where he meets the management and tours the steel rolling mill, which produces iron rods for the construction industry. When the tour is over, Professor Odo seeks the support of the company to establish a similar factory in Ebony State if he makes it to the government house come 2023. He believes the state, which ranks third on the poverty index, can be transformed with the presence of industries. We need private sector participation in our local economy. And that is what is driving our, our effort to ensure that we, we have partnership, collaboration, and coalition in this kind of domain. You know, so we want to reach unemployment. We want to give our people the skills to compete, because skill is what is required in doing all of this. We've seen high-level, mid-level, and low-level skilled manpower in this, in this setup. Oh, definitely. There's no problem. Because scrap is available there in... Because there are two things in the industry. The, your uh, the raw material should be nearby to your company. From here straight to Landcraft Industries Limited in the same area. The company is a leading manufacturer of steel and iron products for different sectors in Nigeria. The governorship candidate has the same message. And we are also excited because they are, they are willing to be part of uh, our, 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 our governance process to ensure that we'll have a plant like this. Maybe not as big as this, but for a start, something that can supply, you know, finished product within our local market. So it's a huge prospect for us, and we're excited about the opportunity to work with them. We'll support to start steel industry in Ebony State because most of the raw materials coming from southeast and north. So it is boom infrastructure of Ebony State, and we also improve, give more employment for local staff, the Nigerian staff. To put pay to his Lagos visit, the All Progressive Grand Alliance Eboyin Governorship candidate meets Ndigwa Association, who also pledged their support to him.